Yes! Jingle Bell Chime! Jingle Bell Chime! What's good, A-plus fam? Welcome back to another video. Well, as you can see, I am alone in this video today because I am sitting outside of the parking lot of Target. I'm so excited to be here because the time has come to start picking out some decorations for Christmas. I feel like I'm doing this really early, but I also feel like if I don't do it early, I'm going to miss out on some of the goodies that Target has. I'm also gonna take a look and stop it at home and definitely stop at Hobby Lobby because they got the uh, half off of Christmas stuff like now. The way y'all are buying these Christmas decorations and putting trees up already and it's not even the middle of November. It's insane to me and I just don't want to miss out. I don't want to be with the skimpy decorations and the skimpy tree and all that kind of stuff. So I'm going to get started getting this stuff popping and get these decorations going. So you guys probably won't be seeing this video until later in November because it just, I don't know if it makes sense to put this out right now. It's just like turning over from November. I still have on my... Okay, wait. For y'all, look at this. I still have on my Halloween nails that I've been trying to take off, but I never have the time, like as of late, to sit there and take these nails off. So they're press on nails, they're Halloween nails, then they've been falling off all of October. I don't know if I'll ever do press on nails again. They are so annoying, but I was really just trying to have my nails, you know, just look a certain type of way. What is that? It's not cute, not cool. Like, I've been running errands today and doing a few things today, and I've just been, I know when I have to use my hands, I've just been, you know, like, handling and handing people my card and, and ID and stuff, and I've just been kind of, like, <laughs> trying to hide my nails, and it's just been one of those days where it's been very weird it's been such a strange day but i hope you guys this day is going well i hope you're remaining positive and i hope that you're pushing yourself to the best of your ability with whatever it is that you are trying to do or accomplish and i hope you're doing it with a kind heart positivity in your heart a smile on your face because woo! so i am outside of the parking lot of target i heard that they have Santas and angels and all kinds of snow people and elves with melanin and I'm so excited because I think it's important to also have Santas and angels and elves and all kinds of stuff with melanin in it. I mean if y'all ain't never seen a Santa how do you know that Santa is? How do you know? You don't know because no one has ever seen Santa. So why are they for never mind let's go into target and let's check out these christmas decorations and start getting these christmas decorations popping i am so excited Christmas, right? It's actually really pretty. They got the red. I'm 
trying to stay away from plaid though. Okay, and they got the candles. Let's smell these candles. Let's see what this smells like. Let's see here. This is called Wonderberry and Sage. Oh, this smells good. This smells just like champagne toast from Bath and Body Works. I like this. Oh, this smells good. Oh yeah, this is actually really good. It's the first one I picked up. So let's try the one. Oh, that's Wonderberry. So pumpkin. Mm, I'm good on the pumpkin. This is calming cashmere birch. Mm, that smells pretty good too. Here we go. I think I'm gonna get the calming cashmere birch because it's completely opposite of the Wonderberry sage. Oh, it smells good. It smells like soap. It smells good. But it smells like soap. Oh, on a Christmas tree smell. I think I'm gonna stick with the silver and gold. These are okay. I'm not feeling that one. Ooh, look at this color. This is amazing, but oh, no, no. got some more of these. I don't think they sold out. I think they just haven't put everything up yet. So they're still kind of putting stuff. need a few silver things. What do they have here? Three dollars. Little diamond drops. Oriented is half off. Look at them signs. Everything. So I'm about to look around and let's see what we can find. Okay, so I need some gold, silver balls, and I'm trying to figure out what color to combine it with. Look at all this. I want to get one of these, but I want it to have silver with it. And See if I could get them a little bit bigger. Okay. I'm wondering if I should do white. Oh, okay. yeah. oh no. <laughs> There's so much stuff. It's kind of overwhelming. But you know what? We're here. I just wanna get away. It's 
but I think I'm gonna, I really do think I'm gonna add white to it. But I don't see any white here. This is all silver. Billy, call 23, please. Billy, call 23, please. Thank you. Billy, please call 23 and ask them if they have white, too. I need white. I think I'm oh, gold. Oh, oh, oh. yeah. Y'all, you know, look. Um, I definitely can't get glass. They have to be shatterproof. If I'm gonna add color, I'm thinking of doing. I don't know if I want to do that color though. That dark green is beautiful. I think next year I'm gonna do a darker. Oh my gosh, they have black. Okay, I can't even look on that side. But look, they do have white. I think this might be cute with the gold and silver. See, they kind of have it by the gold. It adds a silver to it. Like, he got silver around his neck. I think that would be cute. I think I'm gonna do some white. Definitely do some white. Let me see what I can find. White snowflakes, those are cute. And they also have them. Let me see here. I think I'm gonna do some snowflakes. Let's see what else. Oh, these are cute. These are real cute. All right, y'all. Right, Let me see what I can find. so I am back home and it is definitely much later on in the evening but I wanted to go ahead and share everything that I purchased today you guys know that I went to Target Hobby Lobby yesterday I also stopped at a Dollar Tree with the kids and Home Depot with the kids and I also picked up a few things from there so I wanted to share that with you as well so let's get started the first place we stopped at was Target let's start with the ornaments so I got these pine cones and everything that I got except for the candle, I got in the uh, dollar, three dollar, five dollar section. So nothing is more than five dollars other than the candle. So this year I'm going to continue to do the gold, silver color theme, but I'm going to go ahead and add a white to it this year. So I got some gold pine cones. Hopefully it's focusing in as well as I got the silver pine cones. 
And then I also got a few ornaments that I thought were really cute. I got a gold and silver deer. Are these called deer? Are these deer with the big... Or are they called something else? So anyways, I got the gold and the silver. And then I also got the glitter gold with the white glitter. The reason I only got three of these is because I already have, I think they're silver, some silver deer. But I just kind of wanted to add a few more deer to the tree. So this is the one. And then as far as ornaments, I got, I think I'm going to add here and there only because I wanted to add these ornaments as well. So I think this is the only splash of red that's going to be on the tree. So I got the elves. I got the boy and the girl, hence Layla and Santana, which I thought were so cute. These are so cute. I had to get these. And the little girl. And then I also got the Santa. Now Layla says the Santa looks a little creepy, but I think he's very cute. And then I also got this. I thought these were cute because he had a gold nose and gold speckles in on the top of his um hat, his pom-pom. So I thought this was also cute. So this will also be added to the tree. And I got about four of these. So these are going to be the only red items on the tree. Everything else is going to be silver, gold, and now I'm adding white to it. I also got these houses. I thought this was so cute. So I think I'm gonna put these um, by the fireplace. I got two whites and two reds and they're all different sizes. I got two of the triangular rooftops with the chimney. And then I also got the square ones. So these are actually gonna go in the corner of my fireplace. Hopefully they all fit together with maybe like a candle or something. I also got this, and I think I'm gonna have to do some craft work with this. I'm trying to figure out what I could put inside. Maybe like some, oh, all this glitter. Maybe like some um, pine cones or something, but I, I'm not sure what I'm gonna put inside of it. I might spray paint this. I might spray paint this like white or silver, um, maybe even black. I'm not sure, but I think I'm going to work on this and spray paint it. I I'm still working on this, but for $5, I definitely had to cop it and pick it up and I'm going to work with this one for sure. Now I got one gingerbread house that the kids can paint. I also got this was what, five or three? This was $3. This was the last one. So I'm going to go check at another Target to get another gingerbread house so both kids can actually paint their own gingerbread houses and we'll figure out where to put them. They can put it in their room if they want or we can put them somewhere throughout the house. And then like I said, we went to Target a few days before today and the kids also picked up, every year they pick up um, ornaments for themselves. We normally get the ornaments when we get our tree. We told Santana to go ahead and pick out his LeBron James from the Space Jam movie. And Layla picked up her unicorn. She loves unicorns. So Layla picked up this unicorn for the tree. So I'm not sure if this is going to go on our tree because I'm trying to keep everything color coordinated. They might have their own little trees or I might get a smaller tree and put it elsewhere in the house or they can decorate it and do whatever they want with the tree. Because I normally, I think this is probably only the second year where I've tried to keep the tree like color coordinated. We're not adding anything else. It's just gonna be real coordinated, real nice or whatever. But um, I think this year I might buy like a small tree and maybe put it in like another room where they can decorate and put whatever they want on there. Cause they got some stuff from years and years that they've made, that they've bought, that they kind of want to put on the tree. And I figured why not? And then, like I said before, the only other thing that wasn't in the one, three or $5 um, section was this candle. It's the calming cashmere. It smells amazing. I love the smell. It has kind of like that tree birch smell, but with like a hint of like vanilla, but not vanilla, but very vanilla vanilla-ish with the tree, Christmas tree scent, pine, tree, birch, that type of scent. It smells really good. So I'm definitely going to be lighting this up during the holidays to help with the aroma throughout the house. So now on to Hobby Lobby, one of my favorite stores to shop for 
decor items. So at Hobby Lobby, I was there for quite some time. I was really particular about what I was picking out. I really couldn't remember what I needed, but I knew that I needed certain specific things. So I went ahead and just picked some of that stuff up. I didn't go too crazy, which is a great thing because I still need to go through a lot of the older stuff that I have. So let's begin with Hobby Lobby stuff. So the first thing I got was as far as ornaments, I got these icicles. And like I said, I'm gonna start adding the white to the tree. So I thought these icicles would be really nice and look really well with the gold and the silver. And I got about four packs of these to fit throughout the tree. And then I got these snowflakes in white and the bigger ones also in white. And we have these in silver. I'm not sure if we have these in gold, but I know for sure that we have the smaller ones in silver. And then I also got these little doves or birds. Uh, let's call them birds for now. I was saying doves because they're white, but I got these, I thought these were really cute. And these were the last two. I'm definitely gonna have to go back maybe at a later time to see if they have these available. Maybe get a few more, maybe about like, even two more just to kind of even it out into the tree would be fine. But um, I thought these were really cute as well. And then I also got one of them. I wasn't sure about getting two. So I got one of these deer and I got the sitting down one. I first I picked out the one that was standing, but I thought this was really cute. So I'm thinking about putting this one in the dining room, but I really love this deer. I think he's adorable or she. And then I also picked up a few of these for the dining room table. They are candle holders and I thought these were beautiful. I'm loving that it has the um, the Christmas the pine with the flock on it already and it has the very Christmassy look. So I will be putting these on the dining room table with candles inside. I got two of these trees for the dining room. Two of these trees for the dining room table as well. The bottom is made out of glass. The top is plastic, but these are gorgeous. Now I, I think these will look good on my table. I didn't want to go too big. I kind of wanted to stay with the silver and gold because the theme of my dining room is like gray with the darker coffee uh, wood. So these accented with the darker I thought would look better than like gold or red or whatever. So I'm really loving these and I'm excited to see what they're gonna look like in the end. What's clanging down here every time I touch it, it's a tree container, but you can use it as a planter or pot. And I bought, the reason I got this is because I also bought this the other day with when I was with the kids shopping and I got this paper white bulb kit and I thought this flower was beautiful. So I'm actually going to have to hurry up and plant this at least by tomorrow. It, uh, it comes with a plastic black pot already. And it's actually kind of perfect. And I can put it in there and hopefully the plant looks like this and just really grows and I can place this on a table. So I thought this was really cute for it. So I got this at Home Depot. And lastly, what I got at Hobby Lobby were these two nutcrackers that I'm going to have the kids paint. You know, their mouths open up. So I think this would be a cute little activity. Like I said, there's a few things around the house where we get the kids to color or paint or just make it very homey, very, you know, have them involved in the decor. It doesn't always have to be the, the chic, glammy, you know, look. I like to have some of the kids artwork or craft stuff that they do um, throughout the house just to kind of give it that homey feel and let them know that they're part of this whole decor thing too. So yes, these nutcrackers, I'm really excited to see how they're going to paint it and what these nutcrackers are going to look like because they're definitely not going to look like the average nutcracker that we know. So I'll be sure to share that with you guys as soon as they do paint this. Wanted to share, I also got this at Home Depot. I got a new mat for our front door. I'm hoping you can see that it says Mary and Bright. So the kids, you know, oh my God, all this glitter. What is that? The kids love the dollar store. And I love the dollar store for the kids. They love to pick out 
you know, every holiday, they love to add their decor. They actually use their own money to, sometimes they use their own money to pick out some of the decor or pick out things that they want for that season or holiday. So this was picked, Layla picked this out or bought this. And this is just sort of like her little advent calendar or countdown calendar to Christmas. So I'm not sure where she's going to put this, but I thought this was really cute. So the final... Thing that I got at the dollar final few things that I got at the dollar store was this truck it lights up I thought this was cute to just place on a table or somewhere we'll figure out where to place this I'm not sure yet I thought this was pretty cute and it lights up so I think it'd be cute at night just to kind of have somewhere these trees at the dollar store now they were all sold out of this it was hard to find. There were only a few left, so I was unable to get. I wanted two green, but I was unable to get another one of these. And they had a few golds, but they were all, if you can see this one, it's kind of like leaning. I still got it because the others were worse, but I figured I'd just have figure out how to maybe try to straighten it a little bit. I'm still not sure where I'm going to put these, but I'm sure I will find a place to put them. So guys, that is all that I got today. I'm actually really excited to get started on decorating. You guys know for sure that I'm going to be sharing all of that with you because I've done it in the past with Halloween. So I'm definitely doing it for Christmas. So I cannot wait to share our holidays with you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching and hanging with me at Target and Hobby Lobby. Don't forget to like, comment, and if you can, please subscribe with the notification bell on so that you can be notified every single time we post a video because we are about to post videos and we are excited to share a lot of these videos with you, especially during the month of December because it is Christmas and I cannot wait to just share how our family celebrates the holidays and all of the things that we do and our traditions. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. We will see you in the next video. Peace.